while I was in the shower, I remembered something. Because, you know, great thing can happen in the shower. And when I remembered it, I felt stupid. Because guess what I forgot? Good morning, Internet friends, or rather, good evening, Internet friends. How are we doing today? How are we, Sassy? Say, I'm not really happy because I know what's going to happen. She's about to get her nails cut. How are we, Riddler? Say, I feel like being tall. How are you, Emerald? Well, my voice cracked for a minute. Yeah, I'm playing with my rope. So, today was a good day. Worked. Um, the one thing I felt bad about was... How much? How many calories I ate at lunch? Cause, okay, here's the downside with like me using a Fitbit or any kind of like calorie tracker or anything. I get very obsessed with calorie counting. Um, so I feel incredibly guilty, and then I'm trying so hard to work my way back up to a certain number. And I guess that's what you normally do when you lose weight. I don't know, but I just feel guilty about like eating it's like my brain is in like this balancing act of part of it's like oh you need to lose weight quit eating so much crap another part is like well you're a picky eater so it makes losing weight harder for you and then another part's like you need the food you need these calories because you burned off so many today and you need this much to keep your body going because even if you're not using calories by exercising or by working or whatever, you're still using them. Because your body needs the calories to digest food, to for your heart to beat, to breathe. Like, your body uses calories for just about everything. So, it's trying to get my brain to be like, freaking chill, man. But of course, this is my brain. When does it chill? So now, I'm about to cut Sassy's nails. And I'll check back in with you later. Hey guys! So yes, my face is super shiny. It's what happens when I put moisturizer in it. Yay! So, while I was in the shower, I remembered something. Because, you know, great thing can happen in the shower. And when I remembered it, I felt stupid. Because guess what I forgot? If you said homework, you're correct! Woo! I completely forgot to do my homework and it's due tomorrow. Yay! I have put off taking my sleeping pill until I at least get the homework done. I also need to work on the vlog too, so I'm going to be working on that. Part of me is like, don't worry about the homework, this will be like your first zero, but then part of me is like, you need to do it. So, going to try and get that done and get yesterday's vlog done, so let's begin. So here we go again. Another stupid slash lazy moment. So I get my homework open. I'm like, yeah, we're going to do this. Then I realize I don't have my notebook that I need. And my notebook's in the car. And I'm too lazy to go get it. So I'm just like, oh my gosh, I'm stupid. So now I'm going to try tomorrow morning to remember to actually do my homework. Uh, I just feel lazy and dumb. I'm just like, really? Really, Raven? You... Okay, so the reason that my notebook's usually in the car, I've been leaving my backpack in the car, so I always remember to take it. The one time I brought it inside, I forgot about it and went off to school without it. So, now I leave it in the car, but I forget that I have homework, which is every Thursday. So exciting. I just feel really dumb right now and lazy because I'm like I can just go to my car and get my binder but part of me is like no I don't really wanna. I'm gonna be heading downstairs in a little bit anyway to take a little bit outside before we go to bed so uh, I have myself in a dilemma. Good job Raven. Good job. Hey guys! So look at this YouTube multitasking. I am uploading my vlog and I'm watching days at a time. Look Kaylee, there's your face. You have a wonderful face. 
And of course, little bit is about to fall asleep. And the older bits are about to fall asleep. I'm about to fall asleep too. But I need to get this vlog up first, so. We're waiting on that. And besides taking my sleep medicine, it's thunderstorming outside. So, I love the sounds of thunder and, well, not the sound of lightning. The sound of lightning is thunder. Um, I like the sound of thunder. Thunder. Thunder, apparently. Thunder and rain. I like thunder and rain. It's wonderful. It's just so soothing and calming. Like, before I had Ambien, I would use a white noise app a lot. And I'd make sure it had as much, like, storm sounds as I could possibly get. Because I love the sound of thunder so much. But now that I have my Ambien, I don't need it as much. And the last time I played my white noise app, whew, cold chill, with MRL in the bed with me, he looked at me, he was like, Mom, what are you doing? Though I have used that app to expose him to different sounds that he may not normally be exposed to. And he's perfectly fine with it. He doesn't care. <sighs> Sleepy. Um... I mean, I was just thinking of something. What was it? Ooh, oh, that's kind of cute. Let me see if I can show you guys. Let me see if I can zoom in on Sassy's mouth. Look, her little tongue is sticking out. So cute. And look at him. He has a zit on his head. How not so cute. And then look at my baby's eyeball. So cute. That little snoot snoot. It's so cute. Or as one of my college friends would say, Kawaii desene. So. Now before I continue on this weird rambling, I'm going to sign off for the night and head off to bed. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world has for you today. Question of the day is, if you had a white noise app that could play any noise in the world that would help you fall asleep, what noise would you choose? For me, it's obviously thunderstorms. It has to sound as legit as humanly possible. So put your answers down below and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!